All right, so the one that I'm going to show you today is uh, Typing My Clone. All right, so Typing My is a better UI for ChatGPTs. And I love what Tony did with Typing My in here. It's very simple and very high quality product. But if you are people, something like someone like me, uh, you want to build your own stuff, then welcome on board. All right, so because I'm going to show you how to create your own um, ChatGPT UI, all right, so I'm gonna call it Leo AI Assistant. And here, as you can see, uh, on the left side, we have a different conversation. And I'm gonna ask the ChatGPT uh, to create the code for me and it present in a very nice format. All right, and now, um, yeah, even for this one, you're going to create a new conversation. Um, I'm about 75% completion of the whole project and I'll just focus on the feature only. So please ignore the uh, terrible UI for now. Um, so for example here, uh, I'm gonna say, um, maybe just say, all right, something like that. And it's gonna ask the uh, chat GPT, all right, the 10 movies in 2020, and here we go. And at the same time, it just create a new uh, conversation on the left-hand side, which automatically generate the title for this conversation. All right, that seemed to be good. And next, I'm going to ask is like, all right, something like that, and hit enter. All right, so basically I just asked GPT uh, present this data in a tabular format along with the movies and director name and put it in the uh, order number and let's see what we come up with. All right, here we go. So we just customize the uh, table data present in the way that we want. Uh, very neat and very nice. Okay, um, so the other thing is that you can even ask is maybe something like, um, please, create, uh, let's just say a React app for um, to-do app. All right, let's see what we can come up with. All right, so basically it just uh, give me a step and step one, two, three, four, five. All right, and the cool thing is that you're gonna calculate the uh, token that we get from here. All right, um, if you can, maybe I'll just say, um, please, uh, maybe just say write code for each steps. All right, here we go, it's beautiful. And it's very detailed with the step one, create a new rec F um, and run this command and then just uh, create another uh, code block. Beautiful. All right, nice. So now if I want to uh, delete a command, uh, sorry, delete a conversation, I can click on this one and it's gonna display, hit this one to remove that from the conversation. Now all the conversation um, is stored inside the uh, local storage. So if you go here and if you go into application and go into local storage, and here is all the conversation uh, that we just storing in our local storage that we can see here. All right, so I can't wait to show you guys how to create your own ChatGPT UI custom because I think uh, it's a huge opportunity for uh, everyone because um, the demand for the custom ChatGPT UI is gonna be um, very huge. All right, so you can customize the template, uh, especially the um, ChatGPT plugin is coming uh, soon in next month, I believe. So it's the um, huge opportunities for all the developers. All right, I can't wait to see you then. Bye for now.